Good morning. Welcome to another episode, guys. This morning's a special one. We're heading out to Cedar Key. Me and my buddy Brandon Burke breaking nets. We recently raffled off a fishing trip. Amber and I went to the Christian Adventure Network, a local uh, nonprofit that we volunteer with, 10 Can. We went to a banquet of theirs and decided to raffle off a fishing trip. So, a uh, disabled veteran in a wheelchair and we're gonna throw him in the boat and we are going to show him some love and just try and get him on some fish and Brandon's gonna do what he does best and uh, I'm gonna be behind the camera and just try and try and make this as as great as possible for him and uh, continue we'll just show him a good time so let go I'm here with Brandon Burke breaking that uh, I'm just excited. I hope we can get Rick on some redfish, maybe a snook or a yeah. triple tail. Other than that, I'm just glad to get out with you guys and yeah. experience creation. Yeah. I think it's going to be a great time. The weather seems to be perfect. Dear Lord, thank you so much for this opportunity, Lord. Thank you so much for uh, your presence in our life. Thank you for the breath every morning we wake up, Lord. Thank you for everything you do, our health, our loved ones. Thank you for your love and your grace. We don't deserve it, Lord, but we thank you every day for it. Lord, just guide us today to uh, you know, have your wisdom inside of us and just to truly fellowship and pour our love into Rick. Watch over us. Have a safe time on the water. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. All right, guys. We hope you enjoyed this episode. Let's go. Yeah, right now we're using the front of shrimp. Um, believe it or not, all the bait shops where we were striking out on this morning. We, um, my go-to place, they're on vacation. Oh, no. Yeah. So uh, we had to do some backups and they only had frozen. We're all gonna right. be using uh, some cut mullet. Um, so you got a bobber out there. I gotta watch for the bobber to dip. Yep. Something just jumped away. Yeah. Yeah, we'll give a little time here. Uh, this is the bottom of the outgoing tide. So. It's been a while since I fished this spot, but usually it's a pretty good go-to spot. We have J hooks or C hooks? These are J hooks. Um, I got a set of hooks then. Yeah, but it, with the trout, their mouths are soft, so you just kind of pick the tip up and just keep the tension and yep. do a nice steady retrieve. And uh, whatever side he's pulling to, we'll get a net down there. We'll get him dipped up for you. Um, I've never saltwater fished with bobber before. Yeah. Sometimes with uh, artificial baits, you can, it's called a popping cork. So yeah. you can take a little jig and it'll go bloop. Yeah. Oh, another catfish. Yep. Another catfish. Yeah. Big catfish. Yeah. Yeah. Another cat. Yeah. Um, well, we hit this first spot, ended up catching seven, seven or eight catfish. Seven or eight catfish and going to a going to another spot. We're kind of hitting this low tide as it's moving in. So uh, we're hitting a few of these deep holes, see if we can't catch catch some trout or anything else that wants to bite in, but so far it's beautiful day, huh? Oh I got no complaints. Yeah. Better than Let's sitting see. at home. Better than sitting at home, that's it. Yeah. That was a good one. Oh, good right. catch. Whoa. Good catch. All right. That, my friend, is some snook and redfish candy. Yeah, yeah, we're going to throw him. They like to make a bigger nest, so I'm going to throw him to the icebox. But, for the camera real quick, they call it a four man's tarpon. Four man's tarpon, ladyfish. Good for cut bait. Yep. Caught him before? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Small one. We were, we'd fish off the piers in, uh, in Edgewater. You know, we'd get some pin fish or the bait shop or shrimp. Yeah. The first time I caught one, it was, I'm going to say, did it get three and four pounds? Oh, yeah. I've caught them almost uh, three foot. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh yeah, above or below. I'm gonna go. Yep, I don't. Oh yeah. I get that. Definitely got weight to it. 
Nice guy. Four pumpkins. Man, and they're yeah, I in think, season, right? I'm gonna check. Man, and I hear that they are delicious. Yeah, I've never caught a keeper, so this will be a beautiful one for you. Wow. Let's get you a nice picture at the least, and then we're gonna hang on to them and check the regulations. I know you're supposed to hold them way out front to make yeah. them look huge, but. I'm one of those honest fishermen. It's a nice size pump. Yeah. And I'm told they are delicious. I'll take some work and see what we got here. Good job. Thank you. Thank God. See, normally it's not a keeper, no, but uh, is it your first trout? Oh, no. We used to catch them by the boatload. Okay. Yeah. I love them. They're so pretty. First trout for sure. Yeah. You almost landed in here. The two vampire teeth in them. Mm hmm. Oh, it's a spotted one. Yeah, spotted, yeah. Yeah. spotted sea trout. I haven't seen the spots like that in a long time. <laughs> and they are the slimiest. <laughs> yep. Oh, just toss them. Okay. okay. Yep, if you wanted to. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah. All right, well, that was the first species we're targeting. And right, exactly. We're on, the, we're on the track to success. Whatever success is, because uh, I, I think we've already been successful with this. Uh, success is beautiful being weather. Out, being out the water. <laughs> That's it. Breathing, having a good, good, beautiful day. Guys provided for us to be out. And uh, I always say, I woke up with you know, how are you doing, Rick? Well, I woke up on the wheels on the right side of the dirt. That's, <laughs> That's good. That's good. You know, you want to come out, Rick? I have no problem being a poster boy. Um, if people see me out fishing, uh, then they can't sit there and say, oh, you know. I'm like fully stretched. I think he's over slot. Nope, you're good. You ready? Yeah. Oh, oh, thank you, God. Oh. That's a biggin. That scared me when I missed him. Yeah, you got the end spot. I think he you might be bad. flat too. Yeah, I'm saying uh, 25, 26. That's a fat one, yeah. Yeah, that was a good fight, really. All right. All right. Moment of truth. We got 24. 24. Cool. Heck yeah. yeah. That's a fatty right there. Good help with this. Just. <laughs> See, 24. That's two more meals. Yeah. Keep that tip up. Yeah, I, I want to give it a break. Okay. That was on the tail. Yeah, yeah, that one might be over slot there. Yeah, he might be. Man. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's an answer prayer. Oh, 
Holy smokes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys. Yes sir. Oh, you're welcome. Could not have done it without you guys. That's a good one. Beautiful fish. Beautiful fish. Take a picture of those for the wife real quick. So she can see that it's been a successful day. Yeah. I'd like to thank Operation Freedom Beard for donating the trip to Ten Can, and I wanted a raffle. Brandon, I want to thank you for your time. Quite successful. Thank you for your service. Not a problem. I enjoyed it while I was in. My arm's getting tired. <laughs> generosity without your donations you know, to meet you through Ten Can and, and Matthew and all uh, it's just been a blessed day it really, really has been well, thank you for being here thank you for giving us the opportunity to be able to uh, give back and just that's, we appreciate everything y'all have always done and, yeah. still Don't fish you want to catch another one they're, they're swirling up right there <laughs> Super, uh, super good time. We caught some good fish, and that high tide, that high tide came through, and uh, definitely uh, 15 minutes. Two good ones. So, well, Rick, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you you coming out, and appreciate you guys. I really, really do. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, make sure you share this maybe share this with another vet if you guys ever come out towards cedar key area and you know you're looking to have a good time in the outdoors just holler at brandon or i and um we'll show you guys a good time and until then adios appreciate y'all like subscribe all those things if you don't mind if you don't it's okay hope you guys enjoyed it love y'all have a blessed uh blessed rest of your day